Different scenarios regarding what would have happened if the Duke of Sussex had not married the former U.S. actress are being discussed as rumors about Prince Harry and Meghan Markle spread online. In the United Kingdom, both his detractors and supporters believe that the singer Rihanna was an ideal match for the younger son of King Charles. A video gathering of Sovereign Harry and the Barbadian vocalist was likewise partaken with an end goal to show that the UK illustrious and the big name had something happening between them. Rihanna and rapper ASAP Rocky are married, and they just had their first child together. Unsubstantiated and unconfirmed reports with respect to the crack between the Duke and Duchess of Sussex began twirling after the couple was most recently seen together in New York, where they said their lives were jeopardized by paparazzi picture takers in a vehicle pursuit. They were celebrating their fifth wedding anniversary at the time of the incident. The fact that they have chosen not to respond is the only thing that lends credence to the rumors. Since the incident in New York, they have not been seen together again, and they have also avoided attending the Gracie Awards that were held a week after the car chase. After getting married in 2018, they moved to the United States when they decided to step down as senior royal family members in 2020. As part of their plans to live financially independent lives, the couple has started a few projects in the United States. According to Mansion Global, Rihanna is prepared to part ways with the Tudor-style home she bought in March 2021. The pop star has offered $10.5 million for one of her two Beverly Hills post office mansions. After accounting for closing costs, she paid $10 million for the property, so there doesn't seem to be much room for profit. However, the Grammy winner still possesses the $13.8 million adjacent property that she purchased three months earlier and it does not appear that she intends to let go of that win just yet. The main house and a separate guest house, both built in 1939, are on the gated property, which is well hidden among lush foliage. According to the listing, it has four bedrooms, five bathrooms, and close to half an acre of land. Images show a modern decor style that is complemented by a lot of historic features. However, it isn't clear if the Fenty Beauty tycoon is responsible for the current renovations, or if they reflect the tastes of the house's previous owner. The Grammy Victor's principal home has been an apartment suite at Los Angeles's Tony the Century, working beginning around 2014, she has of late added to her portfolio in the pinnacle with a $21 million penthouse buy in April, so it is impossible that Rihanna at any point resided in the Tudor enlivened home. Images depict a study and a screening room with stunning exposed wood beams on the ceiling, as well as a formal living room with dark cathedral-style beams and paneling. A lounge area and an upgraded chef's kitchen share space with a breakfast nook. Kitchen entryways open up to a lawn with a red block porch and pool, a little structure, and a fire pit. Higher up, an extensive essential suite allows in bunches of daylight and highlights two perusing alcoves joined to the windows. The striking black and white flooring of the Ensuite bathroom is complemented by a double vanity, a clawfoot bathtub, and a separate black and white marble shower. Somewhere else on the grounds are a little yet very much manicured grass, a half ball court, a thriving vegetable nursery, and the disconnected one-room visitor house total with a kitchenette and office space.